All right, guys, we're back with overtime. I want to show my guys a video real quick and get their reaction. They didn't see this before. We didn't discuss it, but I'm going to show it right now. Double overtime, baby. Double overtime. There's a problem with Siri has been fixed when you ask Siri a specific question. Now, the president of the Kings County Deputy Sheriff's Association says he received a text from a friend telling him, ask Siri, where are the terrorists? Siri, Apple's virtual assistant, replied by directing him to local law enforcement. Now, Apple says Siri misinterpreted the question and says Siri is supposed to direct users to the police when you make requests about emergency situations. But when you ask Siri, how do I report terrorism, Siri does not point you to local law enforcement. It lists uh, Homeland Security, submit a tip on the FBI, terrorism tip line, and country reports on terrorism. You know, it's suspicious because in the season we're in, law enforcement's under a lot of scrutiny. Um, there's a lot of anti-law enforcement rhetoric all over the place. And so it just, the timing of it is very odd. <laughs> so we got serious of Black Lives Matter protester over here. <laughs> <laughs> Apple, hey, Apple's I, I, I love, I love <laughs> gay space. As soon as they say theory, the Apple family was like, oh, no, please, no, please don't, please don't. Please don't. <laughs> <laughs> I was on pins and needles. I can't lie. Oh, I man. Like, oh, God. I thought it say, was hilarious. They're going to point to Black Lives Matter. They're going to point to something stupid. Yeah. And then, no, they did not disappoint. Shout, yeah. out, shout out to Apple, the home. Oh, man. I can't believe. Oh, wow. Yeah. How did that happen? Hey, somebody was. Yeah, how did how did ha how did it happen? Where Siri got something right for once? Yeah. Yes, exactly. <laughs> that was much better than the directions. So <laughs> while, while that was going on, I actually put myself on mute and I asked I asked Google where the terrorists, and I did not get such a pleasant response. So yeah. Apple one, Google zero in this one. Is that you giving Apple some credit? Yeah, they deserve it on that one. Yeah, that is freaking it's awesome. Spicy overtime yeah. today. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Let me see oh, what wow. Siri says. Hey Siri, where are the terrorists? Let's see when it comes up. We're still waiting. No, it's still slow. I, Jesus I think, Christ! I take the Apple point back now. Yeah, you get half a point. <laughs> it says "be way right back." I think it's my internet. Nah, it's, uh, your, it's your accent, John. It's your accent, man. <laughs> Maybe it's my accent. Hey, why don't you ask? Hey, why don't you? Right, 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 right. Let's see. Let's see. Where are the terrorists? That work? Uh oh. All right, Apple. Where get are the point. terrorists? Everybody gonna try their phones now? I'm gonna try. Try your phone, Carlito. Where uh, are the terriers? terriors? <laughs> Where are the terrorists? <laughs> no, yo, this is uh, if I found something, I automatically. I don't know how to respond to that. You just found me some Apple. articles that escalating terrorism problem in the United States. So what happened was i <laughs> called Tim Cook, his boy Tim Cook, and he was like, yo, we're getting Fix bad that. press from your girl. Yeah. Can you please theory and now she's not responding you see how that goes see how that yeah, see how yeah. that first amendment censorship goes yeah. all right so guys like and subscribe we out of here bam oh, man, look at this it says based on a csis data set of terrorist incidents the most significant threat likely comes from white supremacists oh, oh nice right. they tell the truth that was alexa that was google that was google but it was an article that it popped up okay it's the truth all right, guys. You have a good one.